Guten Tag, Mason Me, wie geht's? C'est moi, Dieter, ich bin Dieter. Dieter's back, yeah, so why so soon, Dieter? Well, I had an epiphany while uh, smelling my Sierra Cedar Sage in the bath. Right, I've been doing a bit of a, a cleanse too. Talk more about that on some other video. If you notice, I have a Canadian flag. I'm wearing my Leafs jersey. Right. So, uh, why is Dieter back? Dieter's back because he, he realized his epiphany was uh, in day 23 of his manhood, journey into manhood, was that he thinks, uh, uh, I've been looking on the internet and I think uh, beginners and people like Dieter who have been enforced uh, against their will or circumstances haven't been able to play for t uh, 18 or 22 months, something like that. You're getting back into it. I, I figured I'm going to do this for primarily for beginners or people like D in Dieter's situation who have been laid off from playing for a while for whatever reason. So I'm going to uh, use a guitar I recommend for beginners, a good one my little Art and Luthery Parlor Nylon. And what I like about this, it has a proper, it's a parlor size guitar, but with a proper classical two inch wide neck. So that's why we're gonna use that. And we're gonna use our, our scale study patterns for guitar, Aaron Shearer. And even if you want to learn electric guitar, uh, I've got a good book I'll, I'll, I'll share with you later for people that want to do that. But you can't go wrong with starting out with Shearer, even, even if you have an electric guitar, we're going to use our Dynaret Rest here. And uh, I have a cool, cool chord I found that has a volume control. Isn't that nifty? And uh, we're going to, because I told you this before. Let me, I tease this, what's going on here? some volume now. So now we've got some volume. I guess I had it turned down too low and hopefully you can see this. So remember I told you uh, on some of my other videos uh, the importance of um, you should practice two scales at the same time and I told you the important keys to learn first of all are C and its relative minor. So C A minor, G E minor, D B minor a, F sharp minor, E, C sharp minor, and F, D minor. So today we're going to do the C major scale and the A minor scale and the F major scale and the D minor scale. Doesn't that sound like fun? So, <clears throat> uh, excuse me. So we'll go to the C major scale. Now, just for the, the point of brevity, I'll, I'll go over the C major C major scale uh, quickly because uh, uh, the free lesson uh, I did before this has the C major scale. So C D E F G A B C. So there, that's all we're going to do with the C major scale, and uh, we're going to go to the A minor scale now, which is the relative minor. And there's actually two minor scales. Hello, hello, there's two minor scales. There's what is called the uh, A melodic minor scale and the A la 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 la. The A melodic minor and the A harmonic minor. So this is the relative minor key for the key of C. So, um, and I suggest you hum when, or, and, and, and try and hit the pitch of the note when you do it because it will improve your ear and if you aspire to sing, you can do your, combine your singing lesson with your guitar lesson. So the A melodic minor sounds like this. Oops. 
Sorry, it's sharps going up and uh, naturals coming down. F sharp, G sharp, A. And then the naturals coming down. So once more, it's A, B, C, D, E, F sharp, G sharp, A, G, F, E, D, C, B, A. And I want, if I don't say sharp or flat after it, it, that's natural, okay? So you got that? So, exercise number one, half notes. One, two, three, four, 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 one, two, three, four. Now quarter notes one. Uh, this is in three four time. One, two, three, 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 one, two, three. And now uh, quarter notes. One and two and three and one and two. Fabulous eighth notes. One and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and two and three and four and one 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 and two and three and four and importance of reading music I, I, I rarely screwed up there at uh, first time right try and do that by uh, by ear and good luck with that so exercise four in three quarter time here we go Rushing this a bit because it's uh, almost 10 minutes. So whoa. that's the takes care of the A melodic minor. And don't do what I just did there. Of course, you want to go slow. You want to go slowly, okay? So uh, you don't make mistakes. So I'm going to post another video for this with the A harmonic minor, and then we're going to do F and the F melodic minor. So that might be three or four more free videos for you. Amazing me. Guten Tag, haben Sie einen guten Tag.